Indian Army may get thermal imager for surveillance. The Indian Army may get advanced handheld thermal imagers for effective surveillance of targets and night operations in high conflict zones such as Jammu and Kashmir and the Northeast. The Ministry of Defense is in the process of procuring 12,389 handheld thermal imagers HHTIs, to be equipped with Global Positioning System GPS, Digital and Magnetic Compass, Inclinometer and Day and Night Channel Binoculars to reduce the number of separate equipment a soldier carries at present. Additional Su not an answer to fleet shortage, IAF tells Ministry. The Indian Air Force IAF, has told the Ministry of Defence that getting more of the existing version of SUKHOI-30 MKI fighter jets is not an option to bolster numbers to the dwindling jet fleet. The SUKHOI-30 MKI, in its present version, is not an option for the future, next 20 years or so, as its avionics, protection suite, engine and radar is now a generation previous to what is currently available, the IAF has informed the MOD. India may increase financial assistance to Bhutan to edge out China. India may increase financial assistance to Bhutan under the neighboring country's next five-year plan beginning 2019 as it reaches out to the Himalayan Kingdom's Prime Minister-elect Lotte T. Shering. With an eye on China, India-Japan likely to ink new pact to access each other's naval bases. Japan hopes to clinch a military logistics pact with India that will allow access to each other's bases, Tokyo's envoy said on Monday, in a tightening of security ties seen as designed to balance China's growing weight in the region. Prime Minister Narendra Modi will be visiting Japan this weekend for an annual summit with his counterpart Shinzo Abe, and the proposed acquisition and cross-servicing agreement between the two militaries is on the agenda. Poland makes official request for U.S. rocket launchers. Poland has sent an official request to buy American-made rocket launchers after announcing in July that the country planned to expedite. According to an announcement on Poland's Ministry of Defense website posted October 19, the country has provided the U.S. a letter of request for one M142 High Mobility Artillery Rocket System, or HIMARS, division as part of what it's calling its Home R program. The U.S. State Department cleared a possible $250 million sale in November 2017 for 56 HIMARS launchers. HIMARS uses guided multiple launch rocket system munitions and Army Tactical Missile System guided ammunition, capable of targeting up to 300 kilometers. Super Hornets Make in India program, SASMOS delivers 1000 Thef, A18 electrical panel assembly to Boeing. Bangalore-based SASMOS Het Technologies Limited, a leading manufacturer of wiring harness, electro-mechanical assemblies and unit integration products delivered for the U.S. aerospace giant Boeing companies the 1000 Thef, A18 Super Hornet Electrical Panel Assembly, on schedule. This marks a significant milestone in the backquote Make in India initiative and underscores the importance of Indian manufacturers in building the future of aerospace and defense globally. The company has progressed from being a startup organization to a preferred partner by OEMs in the industry and created the benchmark in the harness manufacturing industries in India.